Well, ladies and gentlemen, you can see what I'm talking about. You have to pound the, the seam down just a little bit to create enough gap, or to, to yeah, to create enough gap so that the strap will run across the top and end up going through the support. I'm gonna do it to both sides. Allows you to draw the bolt up. It's a nice shiny brand new tank made out of Canada. It's a Spectra unit. And it's got the GM part number on it and it's uh, proud to uh, announce that it's uh, made in Canada. So it's nice. It's not Chinese. It's not Mexican. It's our neighbor to the north and they're putting a good product together. They built uh, GM built the trucks in Canada too, so maybe the plant was converted over and kept making the tanks, but it's the center in it, the center in it, center unit in it. It's got new hoses. Yep. Um, the hoses were rotten. At least the pickup line was. And then you can see that broken area there. I don't know, some of it got broken when I, when I was taking it apart. It's all dry rotted. And I had a problem where I'd get up to 60 mile an hour or whatever, and all of a sudden the, the truck would lay down like it was running out of gas, and I'm thinking maybe it was pulling air at the higher speeds. It just couldn't, uh, fuel demand couldn't keep up. So it's a problem that's been taken care of. Uh, seal up the fuel system and see if I can get a little better gas mileage as a result of that. Thanks for tuning in.